Packers game offensive onslaught tonight, but defensively you held them to very low field goal percentage. Uh, talk about the overall game stopping for you. Well, they lead the nation in uh, threes made and, and we're eighth in, in scoring, so. Um, you know, I thought our activity was pretty good. I thought in the first half they had a lot better looks than they did in the second half. I thought defensively in the second half we did a better job. Um, you know, right now, you know, we just we got to get more active on the ball. Uh, overall, we've we've done a good job. I think we, you know, Ken Palm. I think we're leading the nation in blocks efficiency wise, but we're just not getting enough hands on balls and steals and. Uh, Part of it may be our stat crew, because I know Dylan Brooks got one. They don't have him for one there. So maybe we check the stats. But, uh, um, you know, we, we've got to get more hands on balls. We've got to get more steals. Um, uh, we've got to make more happen with our defense. And uh, I just I don't like our guys are sitting back. We're, we're not using athleticism and, and that to get in passing lanes. And you know, we just got to do a better job getting on them there. We, we, we can get up a lot more. Well, I think, you know, three or four of our guys were talking to their coach about transferring there because they, you know, anybody who takes 53s, our guys love that. So, uh, um, no, it, 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 we knew coming in, they, they play fast and we knew they were going to press us and the floor was going to be open. And, um, you know, we were going to have an opportunity to take some threes. I, I wanted the guys to make sure that they were inside out. I think we only took a couple bad ones. Uh, you know, struggled to get it started. I think we missed, uh, I think we were one for 10 to start the game from three till finally we, we started getting a few to go down. But uh, I think that'll come. I think we're a much better shooting team than what we've shown. Um, and so hopefully guys will get more relaxed and, and we'll uh, start hitting a few threes. Well, we had 36. You know, assists. So I, I thought for the most part, our guys did a pretty good job. I, you know, we didn't take many bad shots, which, you know, we really want to work on. Uh, the turnovers, we had 15 turnovers again, which is our average. We got to get that down. You know, we, 15 uh, is just too many for our style, our team. Uh, we can live with 10 or 11, but, uh, you know, we get up to 15. That's four or five possessions that we don't have that, that we, we don't get back. So, um, you know that's one area we've really got, really got to work on. We got to get those those turnovers down. You know, I thought we did make some progress. You know, we needed a, a couple ball games just to get everybody on the floor and get some guys comfortable playing in front of people. Um, you know, we're we're having a hard time blending. You know, Cavell and Keith. You know, in and and getting it smooth. Um, you know, so I really want to continue to work on that. Uh, um, you know, we just got to get everybody comfortable playing with each other, and, and, and we just don't have that flow that, that we hoped we would have at this time. So uh, it's a work in progress. Uh, this week's really important for us academically. We've, we've got guys finishing up things, so it's a, a real busy week. We're going to try to squeeze some practices in. Uh, but we, we know we're going to practice Friday, Saturday, and be ready for a game Sunday. But uh, this week, you know, we'll do some individual work and, and get them together a couple times. But, uh, you know, the next, I told the guys after the game, next three, four weeks are really important for this team. We, we've got to get so much better in so many areas. Uh, we, we've only got four ball games before conference. Uh, so uh, Alabama's up next, and uh, then we just have a day before Al uh, Montana, and then we go play UNLV in, in, uh, in Portland, and we come back and play Fresno, give them four days off for Christmas, and then, you know, it's, it's conference time. And UCLA, you know, uh, our league needed a big win like that. I'm, I'm happy for Steve, and, and there's those guys going to Kentucky and beat the number one team. Uh, the Pac-12 needed that, and uh, UCLA's you know playing great. I'm not sure what their record is nine and 0, 8 and 0, whatever it is, but they're they're holding up the league, and uh, that was a tremendous win for for them. Uh, but it also helps all of us in the league. Well, he's lucky it went in. <laughs> yeah, that, we, we we will talk about that, but. Uh, um, since it was his only two points, I guess he felt like he had half one. So, uh, but no, it um, it was a fun day for the guys. And uh, like I said, I thought you know 
everybody got a few shots up and uh you know but we do have to build from here no doubt yeah, I mean, it's kind of a slow start and had some turnovers there, but his last eight, nine minutes, you know, were much better. You know, he got a couple assists, uh, got to the rim and got some tip ins, you know, so uh, it'll come. He's just, he's got to keep working in practice, and, uh, but he's got to give us a few minutes here and there. All right, thank you.